don't don't get too over excited it's only two games <laughs> i know what this means <laughs> tell us tell us about this love story ah, you well, and this rcb crowd yeah it's been going on for years and um, you know there's people talk about a lot of other things when you play sport the achievements the stats the numbers look at the end of the day it's it's about um, when you look back you're not going to think of the numbers and the stats it's the memories that you create famously rahul bhai in the change room nowadays says exactly the same to us when you play you play your heart out because you're going to miss these times when you're with your friends in the change room playing in front of fans so the relationship uh, that's happened organically over so many years it's something that i can never ever forget um, just uh, the love and the appreciation and the backing i've received for so many years that's been amazing tell us about today the master of the chase you started off like a train then the wicket started to go does your mindset change as the situation changes or are you just thinking runs balls runs balls what do i have to do look it's um, in t20 cricket i mean i'm opening here obviously uh, i try to give the team a, a blazing start but if the wickets fall from the other end and then you have to understand the conditions you're playing as well the wicket wasn't as as placid as as bangalore is usually it was a bit too paced and i thought that i need to play correct cricketing shots playing across the line wasn't quite working i tried tried a few so i just felt like you know I, i just need a couple of big hits from the other end and then maybe i can get that another big over which didn't happen maxi and and um, anuj got out pretty much back to back and that really hurt us so i was very disappointed i couldn't finish the game off in the end there was a, a ball in the slot ended up slicing it straight to deep point um, but yeah i'm mean, not not a bad start for playing after 2 months and getting into the tournament i'm going to ask you about that in just a moment but while you were talking about hitting correct shots you were showing all your shots yeah coming down the wicket and hitting over cover most times your cover drive kisses the turf yeah this is going to be a continued addition to your game well i mean you have to uh, people, they know i i play the cover drive pretty pretty well so they're not going to allow me to hit gaps and with guys like kg and and arshdeep as well he stole so i mean you if they're hitting length you have to create some momentum in the ball and once you're closer to the ball you kind of negate the bounce that's going to happen you meet it earlier so i mean you have to come up with with a, a game plan here and there um and and try to keep improving your game i know my name is uh, nowadays quite attached to just promoting the game <laughs> in many parts of the world when it comes to t20 cricket but uh, i've still got it i guess uh i think you do <laughs> i i think you do <laughs> tell me the last you, you look, the kids are still too small to understand what their father does but the last two months must have been very very exciting for you tell us about those last two months faf talked about the time off the game as well tell us about those last two months if you can i mean look when you're completely at at ground level you can say um we were not in we were not in the country we were at a place where people were not recognizing us um just time together as a family just to feel normal for two months for me for us as a family was a surreal experience of course having having two kids uh, things become totally different um from a family perspective so just the ability to be together the connections that that you make with your older child um it's it's amazing i mean i i i couldn't have been more grateful to god for the opportunity that i got to spend time with my family um and yeah just just the place that we were in i was telling the guys that when we came back uh the the voices back home felt that much louder i couldn't look up because i was just not used to being called my my name for two months and then immediately you hear these loud noises and then you're back uh, in it all again but it was beautiful it, it, it's it's an amazing experience to just be another person on the road uh, mm-hmm. and and not be recognized and just carry on about about life that that normally people would on a daily basis keep wearing that cap i think you still have it well i don't play for caps and all that anymore to be I honest i mean it's um, for me an opportunity to help my team that's the only thing that i've given to indian cricket to rcb and that's that's the promise i can give here not not probably the orange cap but i'll keep turning up and keep trying my best that's it